Hello Africa, this is Omar Rabia Asin and welcome to CAF Studio. I will be with you through the entire Total Energies AFCON Under 20 tournament. But first, let's take a look on the participating teams. The Total Energies AFCON Under 20 is where the African young talents shine brightest and have their names spotted by football fans. The 2023 edition will feature 12 teams for the second successive time distributed into three groups. And let's get started with Group A. After missing the last two editions, Egypt will be participating in the Total Energies AFCON Under-20 for the first time after six years, considered one of the most successful teams in the history of the competition. The Pharaohs were named champions on two occasions in 2003 and 2013, in addition to winning the silver medal in 2005 and the bronze medal in 2011. Egypt have a rich history of producing top talents during the under-20 AFCON and the 2023 edition will be no different. Bilal Mazhar is one of the Egypt's hot talents and will definitely be a player to watch during the tournament. Will the Egyptian youngsters inspire their nation on home soil? Total Energies Afghan Champions, African Beach Soccer Champions and Total Energies Chan Champions, Senegal still have more to show as they aim to add the Total Energies Afghan Under-20 title to their trophy cabin. Senegal are making the return to Total Energies Afghan Under-20 action after missing the last edition in Mauritania. The Lions of Teranga are hunting their first title in the competition as they lost the final in the last three appearances in 2015, 17 and 19, but are yet to claim the trophy. Senegal will be supported by some of the players who claimed the Total Energies Chan title just two weeks ago. Within the ranks, including the talented Lamine Kamara, who won the best young player in the group stage, and the line of Tiranga's top scorer in the competition, Papa Diaz. Can the under-20 side continue Senegal's domination over CAF competitions? Mozambique might not have the rich football history of their group opponents. However, they are the only team in Group A to feature for the second successive time in the Under-20 AFCON. Coach Dario Monteiro has been in charge of the Mozambique Under-20 team since 2019. Monteiro will be counting on the talents of his midfielder, Kainz Abdallah, Jose Zvala and Jawa Ramos, in addition to the goal-scoring skills of his striker Fangiwi Dinio Monhav. They started their journey in the competition by facing Egypt on opening day. Nigeria are the most successful team in the history of the competition. The Flying Eagles are the only side to win the title three times. The Flying Eagles edged past the reigning champions Ghana on their way to win the under-20 Wafubi regional tournament. 19-year-old Ibrahim Biji Muhammad played a key role in Flying Eagles' qualification for this year's edition in Egypt. The Nigerians who missed the last edition aim to bring the title home after eight years winning the last title back in 2015. How do you think the group will look by the end of the group stage?